We're at the International Builder Show. This is the new American remodel home. Is this not the most amazing shower you've ever seen? So we have the, the body sprays here, uh, the actual rain head, and you got controllers. So what's awesome about this is you can control the shower from here, from in here, from here, and over there. It's been a huge sense of relief and a huge sense of accomplishment, and I had a great team that supported me to get here. This is just amazing. This is unbelievable. Yeah, let's do it. Hey, thanks so much for having us. Yes. Appreciate you. Sarah. Thank you, sir. So, this is the new American remodel. That's right, ladies and gentlemen. This is a, a home that was actually remodeled. So we're going to check this out and see what we learned. We gotta go upstairs. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's go upstairs, dude. We're going up. We're going upstairs. Here we go. This is pretty amazing. Is this not the most amazing shower you've ever seen, though? Check this out. So I think this is like a shower and a sauna and a. Wow. Everybody, Quint Lears, newhomesales.com. I'm here with Michael Gardner, the uh, owner, uh, architect, builder with uh, Luxus Design Build. Congratulations, man. We're, at, I mean, this, we're here at the New American Remodeler Home. How does it feel right now? I mean, I know it's overwhelming a lot of people and stuff. We're probably obnoxious, but how does it feel right now? Uh, awesome. It's been, uh, well, about 15, 16 months of uh, hard work uh, from starting from the design phase to now, and uh, we finally are there. So it's a huge sense of relief and a huge sense of accomplishment, and I had a great team that supported me to get here. You, you have your fingers in all of it. I mean, from the design to the picture to the, I mean, what's your favorite part? What is the stuff that gets you out of the bed that you're just, I can't wait to do that? <laughs> um, I just love to design. I love to put amazing things together and um, take, take samplings from, from my travels, from what I read, what I see, and um, just create amazing projects. Tell me something, uh, just uh, something specific that's inspired you. Maybe it was a building or a country or a, a song or a piece of art. <laughs> um, <laughs> What's kind of interesting about that question is, um, like specifically for this home, uh, the piece of property inspired me. Uh, driving by and seeing this kind of unique property that um, was old and dilapidated, very um, not well taken care of, and just seeing the opportunity of some creating something. This is actually totally next level. Can we, can we go to the bathroom? I just want to yeah. check this out and describe to this because it's... Um, sorry, guys. I just want to let you describe, because I was trying to describe it, and I don't even know where to begin. I'll even give you the mic. Here you go. <laughs> um, so kind of uh, half-heartedly, we call it the car wash. Um, so we have the his, her side, or vice versa, the two-person shower. Um, and it's really about a shower experience. Uh, Kohler took us up to their facility up in uh, Wisconsin, and we got to experience their products firsthand. And uh, we really wanted to replicate that feel and kind of that uni uniqueness to um, what their experiences are like. So we have the, the body sprays here, um, you know, for shoulders, mid back, lower back, uh, the actual rain head for typically everyday showering. The wand here is awesome because it allows you to rinse down tile, the floor, um, you know, after use. And then we have these cool rain heads. So it's really unique about these rain heads is they actually feel like rain. So uh, in most cases, um, the older rain heads would just kind of dump and sh a lot of water on you. Here, it's got a nice trickling effect, uh, which wow. is pretty spectacular. And then, is this a heating element, or what is that? This is actually, um, it's also a steam shower, so you've got some two lower steams down here. And you got controllers, so what's awesome about this is you can control the shower from here, 
from in here, from here, and over there. No, what about music? We listen to music in here. Do we have that or what? No, we actually left the music out. Um, you would get the ambient music from from the bathroom. Uh, we felt that we wanted more of a zen experience in here than more of a typical party shower. I was going to say that. I was talking to the, the uh, merchandiser designer, and she was saying that people are overstimulated and we're trying to tone it down. So yes. I would imagine like you're flat screen with some kind of thing, and, you, and I don't see that. It feels more like uh, some zen Buddhist, like I'm going to do my meditation here or something. Yeah, I think that's kind of what we were really looking for is that I think um, – Homes to me need to be they're a place of sanctuary. They need to be a place that you, you know, we're, we live in this digital world all the time now. Everybody's on all the time. And to have a place where you can kind of go shut down and kind of really relax. And, and when you open up the front door, that's really what we're starting here, right? Is there's a whole layer of experience um, and energy that um, really helps simplify your life. So how do you tap in to your creative energy? like? Is it music? Is it like what, what do you do to go next level out here? <laughs> um, For us non creative types that are trying to be like, you know what I'm saying? It's a bit of everything. A um, lot of music. Uh, I just uh, I spend a lot of time, um, like on this property, we, I just spent time here and it's just kind of how things work for me is I feel that to create a great sense of place you have to understand the place and you have to be in the place and you have to um, spend time understanding the wind, the sun, how how all of these interrelate and so that actually is where I draw my a lot of um, kind of our design inspiration is from nature um, and the human body. We I've studied a lot of the human body I look at homes and buildings as human second skin, right? We have our own, hmm. and then this building is our second one, right? And so I, I've studied a lot about, you know, what does the skin actually do, right? It holds back liquid, but it, it's, it has this permeability to it, so we want that. We want the ability to um, adapt our eyes, right? They, they change, and so same kind of experience with the homes. You want them to evolve, to, you know, change from day to night. Beautiful. Well said, man. I'm glad that you shared that, and... I know you have a big talk coming up. You, you have a lot of people here. Yep. Anything else about this home that you want to share that I'll let you get back? Um, I think it's just, it's, it's to me, it, uh, it's an incredible experience taking it from a 1950s ranch home to something like this, uh, creating energy efficiencies and creating some things that are uh, pretty unique um, when they're all put together. You know, singularly, there might, you might have seen this and that, but probably not all the things together. Well done, man. Listen, right. congratulations. Thank you. Appreciate uh, how it. How do we connect with you and see some more of your products? Um, best way is uh, go to our website, uh, Luxus Design Build, um, or Studio G Architecture. And uh, we have a YouTube channel as well as uh, Instagram and um, Facebook. So check us out there. Hey, uh, what I think, just let me tell you congratulations, yeah. besides just this home, because you have all these press, including us here, and it's going to, you know, share it with somebody else. You're going to share it with somebody else. So you have the potential to reach thousands, tens of thousands, millions of people yep. who are going to change. And so I, just lastly, how does it feel to be on the cutting edge of design? Did you ever think that you would be here? No, not at all. Not at all. Um, you know, I, I've, um, you know, one thing I've learned about being kind of on the cutting edge is you have to take risk. And you have to somehow dig deep, find what the next thing is or what the future beholds from a design standpoint. And um, luckily, sometimes I get it right. Good. We're proud of you, man. Thanks yeah, again. Appreciate it. Thank it's you. Amazing home. Yeah, thank you. That's the most amazing shower I've ever seen in my entire life.